going for a stroll down memory lane. <laughs> I kind of just grew up on two wheels. It was kind of the first thing like Walker and I like took to. Walker was four and Luca was three. I got um, two XR50. So we used to ride around in the schoolyards and the, in the, you know, industrial lots. Then it turned into, you know, bicycles, something they could do every day. So we started going to skate parks and BMX. And... This is where I did first BMX race when I was we we fella, eight years old, so Hendersonville BMX track. I remember coming here like this starting hill when I was little. It's like the biggest thing ever. <laughs> like she's seen better days, that's for sure. My first BMX race, I think when I was like eight years old. And then that was just like it for me. Like I just loved it and just yeah, just started racing more and more. Like Walker and I started like traveling to nationals all like kind of up and down the East Coast. <laughs> this is uh, Hendersonville High School. <laughs> the Bearcats. <laughs> Last, I think two or three years of high school, I was doing pretty much full World Cup season. So that was tough. Like having to come home between races a lot, which was brutal or like having to like make up days. Like, but I remember like my last year, like my principal kind of like cut me some slack, like my last year of high school, but. Got a sick selfie from uh, my last ever day of high school. <laughs> what was the date? Oh, uh, May 28, 2015. It's only two years ago, bro. <laughs> Jump the truck. Dude, we used to be coming and crank. What do you think? Yeah, I got it? That'd be a bad case. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's real gnarly. That wouldn't do it on a BMX bike now. <laughs> Those aren't going anywhere. <laughs> Oh, we're going to the hottest place on earth, Columbia, South Carolina, in the middle of summer. <laughs> Walker always used to be faster, but I think over the last like year, I've, I've definitely uh, stepped it up a little bit. No, I don't know, I think he's probably a little bit braver than I am. A lot of times that's what it comes down to between the two of us, but he'll like send it a little harder, but we're pretty even, so it makes it fun to ride. Like we kind of like have little mini battles. Every day there's a new champion, so. Just tucked in behind you, oh, playing a couple lines. I think that's the most fun thing ever for me. Right there. There's only one thing at the Waffle House menu, and that's uh, the all-star special right here. Elliot said the one thing you're not supposed to say at a Waffle House, he asked for the Grand Slam, and everyone knows that's at Denny's. <laughs> it's guy it's been a couple of years. You got all the basic food groups. You got sugar, fat, carbohydrates, Pro protein. <laughs> a little bit of protein. What you're gonna wanna do is lather it in butter. <laughs> <laughs> Step two, cover it in syrup. <laughs> Step four, four plates of bacon. <laughs> Step five, diabetes. <laughs> we uh, sit around in our PJs all morning while it's nice weather, and then right when it starts to rain, we decide 
Good sugar ride. <laughs> <laughs> Boys, it's really coming down. <laughs> oh! <laughs> if we go like home, that, we're saving a lot of laundry and a lot of bike cleaning. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> <laughs> competition, who can do it the okay, okay, I got the stopwatch out. Luca, you wanna go first? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Twenty four point five. Your new leader. <laughs> How was your day? Pretty sick. I won the chair, boy. <laughs> Petey would be so ashamed. Oh, everyone. This is like good weather. You can weather. This is like the worst thing to do when you already can't walk. of the best barbecue money can buy, baby. <laughs> uh, Walker's more um, gregarious, uh, outgoing. Luke's a little more quiet, reserved, a little more internal. Um, yeah, they're uh, just, they actually couldn't be more more opposite. Kind of feel like I'm a babysitter sometimes, but yeah, I love him, you know, he's... <laughs> he's an idiot. Walker Shaw. Let's see. Luca's on our team, and and Walker's not. And so I'm taking care of Luca. And uh, and Walker, he's just trying to, to make ends meet. But um, yeah, I mean, just, but pitting out of the loo is terrible. Uh, I just rolled into my pit setup. It's really sweet. I just picked it out. It's fully enclosed. Um, you know, keep the bugs out. Problem with Walker Shaw here. He's like, he thinks he can pit in the elite team area. And I know he picked a nice warm spot over there, but he can't be there. There's rules against this. He's an older brother, and yeah, feels like almost, almost so. Pretty strange, but yeah, in that way, it must be embarrassing for sure. Bro's beat, bro. Thanks, bro. Every time I like go to get some food, he's like texting me, asking me to get him some food. I already got him a place to stay, and he just keeps asking for stuff. It's like really exhausting to have him here, really. Whatever, just gonna try and block him out. I feel like I'm getting back to where I should be. Leo Gang kind of turned it around and had a good result. Seventh and just less than a second off the podium. So I feel like I'm kind of right where I need to be, and so it's good. Doug Hatfield, he's my mechanic this year. Been wrenching on my bike, so he makes me laugh. He's funny, he's always upbeat and super positive about everything, which is amazing. Been doing it for 30 years. I don't know, <laughs> something like that. A lot longer than I've been alive, so. <laughs> you know, all the people he's worked with, all the great racers over the years, and uh, to be on that list is pretty cool. Having so much excitement around the new bikes and the new riders on the, on the Syndicate program, and again, it's been an honor working with these guys. I just love it. Yeah, it was pretty much perfect all day. First run, like it was just a tiny bit of grease, like the roots and rocks were just a little bit slippery, but by the time the sun was out a little bit, it was perfect. And uh, yeah, the dirt kind of held together a little bit better than last year because of the, it had some moisture in it, so track was good. I'd like for it to stay that way. <laughs> Quality was good. Had a good run. I ended up seventh. Um, I feel like I'm kind of building steady and starting to get like consistent good runs in. Just keep it going tomorrow. I know um, if I have my best run, I'll be right where I want to be. Jason, look at Shaw. Oh, oh Shaw is down on the time here. Quite a long way. I know I had a good good run in me and 
definitely, uh, it's a weird feeling. I don't really know what I could have done different, so it's, it's hard to like learn from it really or anything. You just kind of just gotta move on, so. Yeah, teammates are killing it. Stoked for them. Yeah, Loris just off the podium. It would have been good to see Greg win. It was so close, and so. I know I would have been right up there with them, so just uh, take that and move on. What is it? It's uh, water. Oh, yeah, water. <laughs> it's basically it really deep deep back water. Water. That's what it was. Yeah. Hey, Petey. We are in uh, Lenzerheide, Switzerland, fifth World Cup of the year. Yeah, the goal this weekend, I think, is podium for sure. I think last couple of races I've had the speed and it just hasn't worked out or I've been really close. So I think at this stage, I just, I really want to get it back on the podium and just have some good racing. Oh man, sixth. It wasn't bad, but it wasn't my best run. I knew as soon as I crossed the line that I hadn't done enough, but Greg won the race. I know he'll say that he didn't think he deserved it. With Gwyn, he probably would have won this one. I think no one was going to argue that, but yeah, holy crap. It probably wasn't the nicest way to win 21, to be honest. You know, Gwyn, he didn't make it down to the bottom, and, and he was ahead, but uh, he got to get to the finish line. It's all like, yeah, I don't know. But it's 21, I'm very stoked about it. I talk all the time about how I always want to like ride new trails. I've ridden a lot, but like definitely not all of them. And it kind of just keeps it fresh that way. Like we're always just mixing it up with what we're riding. If we're on hardtails or road bikes or XC, moto, whatever. I kind of get like sick of it sometimes and it kind of gets boring, but I think like it's kind of like all the like fundamentals, like pumping and turning and all that stuff. So, and it's fun just to mess around. So, I owe a lot to this little patch of dirt. I think. Yeah, early start today. We're uh, out of the house before before 9:30, so it's <laughs> a little bit of a wake up call. Yeah, this is like Pisgah, so it's it's uh yeah I ride here a bunch. It's uh it's huge. Like I feel like I've only. Live here 12 years and probably barely scratch the surface of it. So there's uh, there's some cool trails though, and it's kind of a different style of riding, a little bit more like natural stuff. When we were racing BMX a lot, I would always like want to make sure that I'm beating him. If we were racing together or practicing together, and I was going faster than him, he would always make sure that that didn't last long. So here he comes Walker Shaw, everyone. I think we do that a lot. Like, if I'm going faster than Luca when we're when we're doing downhill runs or whatever, like he's like, shit, I need to step it up. So yeah, it's it's fun that way. It makes riding more fun. So. Not impressed. <laughs> I've got him. I'm gonna try and jump it. It looks way too big from here, but then when you get on it, real talk, he, he's gonna. I'd say 60 40. Good thing you weren't on 29 or dude. <laughs> Got that out of the way. Season. So they green night for good reason. Say I am ripping UK, that's treason. Blessing all the man is. Say he gets a top ten or a solid result. I'm so stoked and like over the moon for him. But it doesn't surprise me really because I've seen like how fast he is and I see him ride every day. Yeah, I'm definitely proud of him and I know that he's going to keep getting better. I've never seen anything like it. Here we go. He's got another chance. Can he hit it? Oh, <laughs> <laughs>